Donald Trump officially endorsed Roy Moore this morning. The president offered his support by phone and on Twitter. NBC 15's Christian Jennings joins us live in our newsroom with reaction from local political experts. Christian. Well, Kim, Greg, experts tell me Trump's endorsement isn't a surprise, although they don't feel it will make much of a difference this late in the race. Just eight days before the special election that has garnered national attention, President Donald Trump officially endorsed Republican Senate candidate Roy Moore this morning, saying, quote, putting Pelosi Schumer liberal puppet Jones into office in Alabama would hurt our great Republican agenda. His support comes just four days before Trump pays Pensacola a visit for a campaign style rally. I don't think it's going to change anybody's mind at this particular point. I know that probably most people have assumed that Trump would eventually come out in support of more. USA political science professor Dr. Sam Fisher says most people have already made up their minds. Though Moore is accused of sexual misconduct with teenagers while he was in his 30s, local political expert Jonathan Gray says time heals all wounds and the allegations may have come too early for the Democrats. I think all of the attention on this from Jimmy Kimmel, all of the national media, even what the Democrats have done has helped Roy Moore. And now you're seeing a lot of angry Republicans who are starting to believe that this was a smear attempt, that this was the outside national media trying to come in and tell Alabama what to do. And I think you should see some really angry Republicans on election day. Still no word if Republican candidate Roy Moore will be invited to participate in Trump's rally in Pensacola on Friday. We have posted a link on how to get tickets on our website, mynbc15.com.